my name is Claudia Torian, and I work for a company called, an uh, organization called Cycle More. Have you guys heard about us? We've been yeah. there. Huh? You've been there? Some of you been to the, um, to the recycling center? Yeah. Oh, okay. Good. It was for a field trip. Oh, well, then if you've been to the recycling center, I know you can tell me what goes in that blue bed right quick. Let's do that before we go on, because that's what's funding me, is what goes in that blue bin. Give me one thing. What kind of recyclables? It's like glass. Glass. Ooh, very good. Very few people get that. You guys know about the four R's, right? Yeah. yeah. We just talked about one, right? What was that? What do you do when you put stuff in the blue bin? Your arm? Recycling. Recycling, right? And then reuse. The, huh? Reuse. Recycle, reuse. Reuse, okay. Recycle. Reuse. 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 Very good. You guys are on top of it. Recycle. And there's Replenish. one more, and that's what we're doing today. What's that? It um, rhymes with hot. It starts with the R. Right? Rot. 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 Okay. Now we think rot is hot, but rot is when organic matter decomposes. You guys know what decompose means? Yes. Yeah. Compose means to bring it together, and decompose means to take apart. Take apart or break apart. Very good. Well, so a couple more things about worms. Middle. In the middle. Always remember that. Food in the middle. Never on top. So remember, food always where? Middle. In the middle. So when I open this worm bin, do you see the food? No. no. And you don't see any worms because they're happy because they're down in there doing what? Eating on this food. But when I pull this back, you start to see food, you start to see worms. Oh, it looks like it. I'm going to let you guys come in for a minute and take a look. But I want you to know now there's there is no dirt in here. This all used to be my lunch. Okay, well we take our le lunch leftovers like the apple core or the banana peel or the avocado shell and the seeds. So a couple of other things you need to know about worms is they like temperatures between 55 and 77 degrees. Right? And if it gets too hot, like over 80, they start to cook and they'll die. Now, interestingly, if they freeze, they actually can thaw out and come back. Nature has pro programmed worms so that they freeze, and this is something I've seen science class do. They'll take worms and put them in the freezer, freeze them, and if you put them down in the refrigerator and let them thaw out slowly, they will come back. This is fun. Keep passing out paper. Yeah. How much? How much? How much? That's that's. Yeah. Let them do one more. You're gonna need a lot. Wow. 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 Wow.